Hi guys, I'm Claire and welcome back to my channel, or to my channel if you are new here. Sorry if you can hear my heater, it's like negative 30 degrees outside, so uh, yeah, that's, that's running. And excuse the hair, I know it's really like big and on top of my head. I needed it off my neck, it was driving me insane, so. Now I'm sorry that this isn't the cookie video. I know in my last video I said that it would be. But with it being Christmas and trying to finish up all these presents and everything, the cookie video is still coming. It's just going to be after this video. So, don't be mad, please. It is coming. This is just coming first. So as the title said, I'm sure you saw what it said. I am creating Christmas vacation sweatshirts for the two dads in my life. My dad and my husband's dad. I'm gonna be doing the cat, the, the burnt cat, I don't like saying that, with the fuzzy outline and some Christmas lights, so. I told you you had too many plugs in one outlet. Oh God. What is it? Nothing, let's go in and finish our dessert. That thing had nine lives. She just spent them all. <laughs> Woo! I'm super excited about this. So for today's video, I'm going to be using this sweatshirt and this sweatshirt. I also will be using this black tank top to make the cat design. So, oh, I should show you what else I'm going to be using too. Let's do that. Let's be professional artists and do that. Okay, I got the rest of the stuff. So this, these are like boas. They're considered feather boas, but they don't really feel like feathers. This is what's gonna be the cat fur. That's the outline of the cat. And then at Dollar General. Honestly, at this point, Dollar General should just sponsor me since I'm there all the time. It's pretty much my second home and I buy so much for these art videos from there. So let's sponsor me, Dollar General. <laughs> I got four of these. They're the light necklaces. And you can make them light up. So I figured that would be a really great addition, especially because they look like the old style. Oh, I could just hit this. Haha. <laughs> There's a button up here, too. They look like the old style lights. So. Let's get into it. Now that I showed you everything, let's get into do a top-down view and get into this. I will be using my sewing machine, by the way, but um, I'm not going to hold that up in front of the camera because that weighs a ton. So, um, yeah, we're going to be using that to make this go a hundred times faster because all I have is tonight to work on these because tomorrow's Christmas Eve and I'm going to be giving them to um, both dads so that they can wear them. All right, top-down view. Alrighty, don't mind the tablecloth with the placemat underneath it. I watch two little boys every single day before work, so um, this is to keep the table protected. So we're just going to wipe it off. And red's also very festive. So first, we're going to start off with the tank top. And I'm also really sorry for this angle too. I'm working at my house because uh, it's negative 30, so the art room is really cold. And um, it's also like almost 10 o'clock at night, so we're working with what we got. So with this first, I'm going to cut out the cat design. And um, I'll show you what it looks like. I'm going to save you guys, expire you guys from the agonizing my scissors don't work session. So we're just going to do a quick transition. So here's what it looked like before to this. Now, they don't have to be perfect because they're going to be covered up with the feather boa, so I'm kind of happy about that. But let's get these onto the sweatshirts now. All right, so, ouch, I just poked my finger. <laughs> so, here's the cat pinned to the first shirt. I'm going to um, sew it on. I just have gold thread in here. Uh, since I'm going to be covering it up, I don't really care what color it is because I'm just going to be going along the edge of the design. So, um, do if you're doing this, which I don't know, maybe you are, use whatever color you want. 
I'm going to actually use white thread whenever I have to put the feather boa on, but for this, I can actually see what I'm sewing and what I'm doing. So, um, that's why I'm using gold. This thing is dusty, dang. <laughs> sweatshirt there is it's not pretty I I definitely am in no way a professional um, this is all for fun and um, you know trying things out the nice thing is I get to cover this up with the feather boa so it's also why I wasn't too worried about it but it looks good there's the cat so far on the sweatshirt now I'm going to get the cat on this sweatshirt and then we'll go from there and here is the second one again no way a professional i honestly almost cried because um this was out of thread and I was so scared that it wasn't sewing on the bottom, but it just made it. It just made it to the very end of the tail and then it was done. Like I got these two done with that little spool of thread and I'm so happy that it didn't run out while I was doing it because that would have been so difficult. I was worried the whole time that it would, but oh, okay. Now we're gonna put on the feather boas. Um, I gotta figure out how I wanna do that. If I wanna do the sewing machine or just hand stitching. Let me think. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. All right, so here we are with our feather boa for the next step. I think there's a few ways I can do this. Um, I think I'm just gonna make, or take the boa and just put it straight across the legs and the tail and then across the edges because if I go like this around it, like I lay it here and I turn it so it goes around, it's just a puffy mess. So if I did this, it's the same thing, right? So um, I think that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> So the cat is finished on here. So the next step for this one is to add the lights to it now. Day two. All right, so it is the next day. I did not, did not sew these on last night because it was about 12.30 in the morning and I knew I needed to get to bed. So I'm gonna sew these on now and then we'll get onto the other sweatshirt. <laughs> And so I put one of the light things down here and one up here. So that's what it looks like. <laughs> it's so cool. I love it so much. There's feathers everywhere all over this house. These just come off so easily. And now that that one's done, let's get the other one done. thousand years later. All right, and it's all done. Well, guys, this is the end of the video. I'm sorry if you can hear rain. I'm doing this outro outside because it's warm enough and nice enough to actually sit outside right now. It's uh, uh, Christmas Eve, New Year's Eve. <laughs> And it's about 60 degrees and it's raining. So I just wanted to sit outside because uh, I don't remember the last time I really got to do that. So we're doing this outro outside. <laughs> I will write socials and everything, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, 
vlog channel. Um, if there's anything else, I'll also write on the channel here some on the, <laughs> on the screen here somewhere. Um, I don't know where that'll be. Which side, top, bottom, on my face? No idea. Um, but yeah, go check those out. Hit subscribe here. That would really, really help me. And I'd love to have you along on the journey, especially for the new year, to see what like I create and what I do and everything. And um, if you want to give this video a like, that would help me too. So please do so. Thank you so much. <laughs> and I'm sorry that the Christmas cookie video is not up yet. Um, I know that was supposed to go up before this video. And the next video that's coming out is my 2022 year in review and resolutions so it will not be the Christmas cookie video next like I said it would be at the beginning of this video um we'll see when that gets up either it's gonna be in like January or February or it'll be Christmas in July of 23 or it'll be Christmas of 23 so we'll see it's probably one of one that I will film soon and if I hold on to it then I hold on to it and if I don't then I don't so we'll see what happens I'm sorry it's just not out yet but I will see you guys in my year in review which is coming out uh, January 1st 2023 at midnight so um, thank you guys so much for watching I'll see you guys in the next one stay safe stay healthy rock on guys